Well, a once popular skating rink announced today that it will close its doors for good. News 18's Elizabeth Rentschler has more on the Great Skates organization and why the owner says it was time to lock the doors for good. Elizabeth. Yeah, it was a really sad day out there, but I did get a chance to put some skates on. I thought one final go <laughs> at it. Wasn't as good as I used to be, I can say that much. And unfortunately, members and owners say that their finances weren't where they used to be either, and that's the reason they needed to close. It's really heartfelt. It's a day Great Skates founder Don Stein says he hoped would never come. But for the last six months, he says it's a day he knew eventually would. On Tuesday, Great Skates announced it would close its doors for good at the end of the month. It's had a uh, substantial loss um, almost monthly since uh, late 09. And our family has been picking up the shortfall. Great Skates opened back in 1999 from a bright idea Stein says wasn't even entirely his. A youth group from Sunnyside approached me as a businessman uh, looking for facilities where they could have fun, where it was safe, where it was healthy, and their suggestion was skating. Great Skates was, of course, known for its skating, but Stein says more importantly, it was known for its contribution to the Boys and Girls Club. Then at one point, we uh, were able to purchase a portable classroom uh, from another community, and that incident in its own, uh, in its own was $40,000. But Boys and Girls Club Executive Director Barry Richard says with its financial state, donations from Great Skates over the last several years have been close to nothing. But Richard says the club will forever be grateful for what the skating rink did for the community. It was a great opportunity for families to have an activity, uh, entertainment, amusement to go to. And we're always in support of something that makes it nice for the community members. While the legacy of Great Skates may be coming to an end, the memories could be yours to keep. On June 20th, Stein says Great Skates will hold a public auction benefiting the Boys and Girls Club. Stein says it's the only way he would want this story to end. We have no regrets other than the fact that it, everything, I guess, comes to an end at some point. And again, that auction will take place at 9.30 a.m. on Thursday, June 20th at the Great Skates Building. Elizabeth Rentschler, News 18.